Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your September 2018 general reading. It's a general read, so it will not resonate with everyone who views the video. But if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Alright, well, let's go. What are we doing? So there's like a heavy energy of anxiety, fear, not knowing and but you guys are masking it very well people don't know that you feel this way um i heard secret plans secret plans whatever that means some of you just had babies congratulations um <clears throat> babies you you were prepared for and those you weren't some of you, your your marriage, your relationship is upside down. Um, you guys are not talking. There's a disconnect. There's a breakdown in communication in the home. Your children, there's children in the home. I think that's what still gets you guys uh, or keeps you guys together. Or you know, if there is dialogue, then it's concerning the children. Somebody's getting a lot of attention that someone could be famous. So, you know, I don't know. Getting some recognition. Some of my cancer women have their back turned to an offer. Someone's offering. They put their cards on the table. They, you know, spoken their truth about a situation and they're just not taken to it. I think this person has hurt you in the past. It's just not feasible. You're just not open to it right now. There are a lot of things hidden for you. Like spirit is working on your behalf behind the scenes. Some things you don't know. Some things you just wouldn't even imagine. Uh, that's the not knowing there. Uh, some of you started new jobs or you, you're looking for a new job. Um, there was or is promotion. Money is here, but it's you're you're spreading yourself thin. So a lot of my cancer people, a lot of times in life, they feel like the underdog. They feel like the person that was left out, the 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 castaway. They, you know, playing the victim is not is not beneath the cancer, and, and it sometimes they generally could have been the victim. So a lot of times when you feel like you're the underdog, you grow up, you do things better in life, you get better, make more money. Now you have something to prove. It looks like for some, and not all, for, for some cancers, it's like you are you're spending money and doing things just so people can see you or people can, you know, give you those those accolades and, you know, condone what you're doing. And, you know, so you have something to prove more so to yourself. You think it's to other people, but you you got to really get with self on that. Legal matters are here. I can't see how they turn out, though. Get in the cards. Get into the cards. I'm happy. So some of my cancers are happy. I mean, if you aren't, then, you know, it's take to some of my happiness and um yeah okay where are we going let's go here let's ask the cards we're gonna do free form let's ask the cards what what does cancer need to know about love love messages for cancer what does cancer need to know in regards to love love messages for cancer okay And it's flipped out. We'll put it back. If it comes back, then then we know. Whoa, your cards are 
Love messages for cancer. What does cancer need to know? We'll leave it at four for right now. Six of cups on the bottom of the deck. Nice. Six of pentacles, five of wands, high priestess, six of swords. What I talked about, secret plans. Secret plans here. You know something. Secret plans maybe with a Piscean person. If not... Um, maybe with a very intuitive woman, maybe even with a woman who is in a, um, accounting or something to do with books or bookkeeper, book, uh, a writer. Some of you are writers. Um, you got some secret plans. You're waiting on some information in regards to some plans or some things you've done, some missions I'm hearing. Um, yeah, you're waiting for that opportunity that brings balance for you. Either this is a person or an opportunity. Uh, for some of you, it's going to be an actual person. Uh, we have a Six of Cups here. There's so much inner conflict. Like I talked about, high, anxi high anxiety, um, frustration, not knowing. The not knowing is here. Uh, oh, I just moved the cards. I'll take it. I've got the Ace of Pentacles and the Seven of Wands. All right, nice. You've done a lot of work for this new start. A lot of work in regards to defending yourself. Some of you might be in sales. This is sales. Like, because, like, yeah. Some of you might be or in a position where you have to either sell yourself or you have to, um, you have to fight for the opportunity, even at your job. I don't know. You know, you have to stand your ground. Have to fight people off. Some people are coming for your money. There's a new foundational start, though. It's it's here for you. Uh, business, home, car, engagement, moving in together, large purchase. Uh, some of you are in sales. Some of you fighting off some things. Let's get, let's get another spread. See what's going on. Um. Yeah, so high anxiety about um, some of you are wondering, am I going to do good at this new job? Um, this promotion, is it for me? Yes, it brings more money, a, a larger payout, but you know, you're doubting yourself. Five of sword. Oh, no. All right, so we've got some interference. Opposition. We might even have harsh words here. Let's see. Page of Pentacles. The Tower. Nine of Cups. The Lovers. In order to get what you want, you have to fight for it. And you're going to have to fight one or one of these people here. you got to make a choice of who you want to be with. The one that you leave out, you're going to have to, you know, verbally fight. I don't even know. Some of y'all might be physically fighting this person um, because of this tower moment. When, when, they, when this person finds out that this is my... I, messages of stability are elsewhere card like what i've been doing with you i'm pretty much done with um i want to start to start i want to um establish something long term or i have already be begin or uh, begun to uh, establish something long term elsewhere and it, it looks like it gets found out the tower here you're getting wish fulfillment by way of 
making a choice and, and having to fight for it. This could be Gemini, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Uh, some of you have a new baby in the home. Someone finds out about this new baby. Yeah. And you're going to have to make a choice. They, they're like, is it your family? Yeah, you're going to have to fight some very dominating, boi boisterous, outgoing. Um, I'm just hearing dominating woman. Queen of Swords, Nine of Pentacles, the world. And then the Ace of Pentacles again. Um, some of you got to fight for your independence. Now that is, of course, physically, emotionally, and mentally. Um, and uh, yeah, physically. So somebody is not letting go. I did see the Four of, Sword, four of Pentacles. It was shuffling. You're going to have to get real and tough and cut something out and get strong so that a cycle can end so that the Ace of Pentacles can come in for you. Once again, fighting. You're going to have to fight for this balance. For what you wished for. Ooh, whoever you wish for, you feel like they just... This is um the dream person. The ultimate partner. Yeah, you got to go in a new direction. But it looks like whomever you're with is not letting you go. This could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. We've got uh, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. It looks like um, maybe some of my Cancer women are turning down Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. For whatever reason. Okay, let's get some oracle cards. The angel answers, angel answers oracle cards. So if you have questions out there, I'm going to pull two cards in, and they'll give you the answers to your questions. Come Thank you for the angel answer. Get some butterfly oracle cards. Give us some guidance. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Heavenly Father, for true messages from Cancer Collective. Messages of love and light, truth and clarity. A lot of competition around you. Uh, I'm here, you're playing with the big dogs now. I think this is for some of you who have new positions. Uh, some of you are trying to get out of situations that you've you pretty much created for yourself. Um, at one point you saw this person, the situation as long term, but now you don't. And it's like you have to completely unravel and untangle yourself from a person that is not letting go. Okay, at the bottom of the deck, religion and spirituality. At the bottom of the deck, uh, Scorpio also had this. So some of you are dealing with Scorpio. Um, let's see. Dietary change. Family changes, sobriety, um, new baby, new home, new job. Um, I mean, family changes is everything. So we're moving in out, moving out of the home, uh, moving in the home. Um, yeah, just people exiting, entering, kids going back to college if that's what you're dealing with. Veganism, vegetarianism, pescatarianism. Look at your diet and see what it is or how it is you can improve it. Sobriety, not just, and this can talk about sobriety of the mind. A lot of you are dealing with a lot of high anxiety because you're trying to make changes in your life, but nobody wins in this situation with the Five of Swords coming out twice, you know, because some of you are trying to move away from. And then this person is upset and they're mad and they're sad, but you've made someone else happy and yourself happy at the same time over yonder. <laughs> but 
it is causing you some real high anxiety get to a quiet place listen to you be true to you what do you want okay bottom of the deck angel answers Ooh, we gotta know it might be a good no though um no you shouldn't just leave the home turn off all the utilities and never come back oh no you shouldn't um <laughs> it's not what you do it's how you do it so um keep that in mind all right romance ask for help from others okay this cap falling out of the deck for you for some of you y'all are trying to get to your dream person you're trying to be there like i said you got somebody over yonder and you are trying to get there because you want this with this person um whoever you live with or whoever you're with right now you both are pretty cold to each other um it didn't have to be that you guys speak like so harsh to each other but it's just tension it's just coldness in the air um for whatever reason okay yeah and then reconsider you got no and reconsider whatever that may be um, okay so cancer i hope that this message helped you out gave you clarity about your situation what's going on with you um if you feel like you want a personal reading all of my information is below follow me on Instago over at uh yeah it's a iphone app so if you have an iphone or apple device you can find me on instago um you can also find me on instagram um that's not where you request a personal reading though uh go over to my website send me an email that's how you will request a personal reading uh yeah cancer just know that when in doubt pray i am praying for you pray for me as well take care guys